briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 2002, the Alaska Supreme Court considered a case that dealt with how income changes may impact mandated child support payments. The fundamental legal question examined was whether a drop in income, due to a voluntary career change, should affect child support obligations. The heart of the case focused on William Olmsted, a father advocating for modifications to child support payments due to a shift in his career trajectory. In 1994, upon his divorce from ex-partner Elizabeth Ziegler, they had mutually agreed to share both physical and legal custody of their offspring, with neither party required to pay child support. Inconsistent with the earlier agreement, Olmsted later petitioned the court for a modification based on his shift from a lucrative career as a lawyer to a lower-paying profession. In an intriguing but judicious twist, the trial court where the case was initially heard provided a ruling to the contrary. The court refuted Olmsted's claim and implied that he chose a lower-paying career unreasonably and voluntarily, contributing to his classification as being voluntarily underemployed. Consequently, the court denied his plea to modify the child support payment structure. Not dissuaded, Olmsted brought his case to the Alaska Supreme Court, adamant about an appeal to the decision. After consideration, the Supreme Court affirmed the trial court's finding. Olmsted was willfully and unjustifiably underemployed, and his reduced income did not warrant an adjustment to the child support arrangement. Determinations of his earning capacity were not found to be erroneous. Therefore, the Supreme Court elected to maintain the status quo, rejecting Olmsted's appeal to adjust the agreed-upon child support. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lsd.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.